Hello. How's it going? Hey, Paladin. Hey, Garlic. Hey, Allie. Thanks, guys, for for coming over and saying hi. Ellie's here with me. She's hanging out. I'm back on this monitor. So I've got chat here and I got game here. Um, I didn't really give it a shot the, the other day. I kind of just, like, moved it back. Um, but also... Uh, I got a new monitor for work, and so now I've got, like, it doesn't, it doesn't quite fit. So if I put the webcam on, on this monitor, then you see the side of my room that I don't want you to see. So I'm going to move things around and fiddle with it some more. Um, but I think this is, this is not bad. I like this, I like being able to, like, look at chat. I'm talking to you guys, be like, hey. Um... So, I don't know. We'll see see how I like it. Um, yeah, I guess we'll just jump back into it. Like, I don't know. I get, like, a smidge nervous when I play this game just because I don't know what's coming. And I'm like, is it is it going to be sad? It's going to be sad. I don't know if I'm ready. This game looks really nice on this new monitor, I will say that. That is true. Alright, where did we leave off? So, most recently we had talked to the storekeepers here about how... I forget her name, but the woman called uh, uh, Protective Services for the, when they were kids. Um, And never prepared for what was going on in Life is Strange and this game is very similar. It sure is. Yeah. Alright, well I... Yeah, I remember we just had that big argument. Let's see how Allison is doing. Oh, right, and then we like switched characters and we saw everything from each other's perspective. Oh, right. I've got I've got a little notepad here. So I'm, I'm playing on a, a PlayStation controller, but it uses the Xbox con, uh, command. So I have to like keep this in front of me to remind myself where everything is. Oh, thanks. I mean, it works. It, it really does work. Um, Where'd that question about our father come from? I have no idea. Oh, hey, Loof. I don't know. It was a weird thing to ask, I guess. How was the rest of your uh, your stream earlier with Doom? I, you're making me want to get that game. I keep like seeing it, um, uh, like used copies for sale, and I'm really tempted to pick it up. Uh, hey, so you look less than thrilled with the plan. Yeah, like I said, I am not stoked to be going to the cemetery. Oh, that's right. We're going to the cemetery. Um, you won't be going alone. I know. But I'll be there too. And my Still just scratching I'm not the surface. Sure I wow. To him into this. Hey, he offered. He wants to be there for you. <laughs> for me, huh? Well, we need to get the store closed, so go give him a hand. You have a craving to conquer the no respawns challenge. Is that kind of like a no death run? Um, because if so, I would. Okay, good luck. I am never brave enough to try something like that. Ultra Nightmare, it's called. Of course it is. Um, I follow um, I follow another streamer named Mira who um, is doing permadeath for um, The Last of Us 2. And it just looks so hard. Um, I, I couldn't imagine. We're not supposed to go? I thought we were going to the cemetery. Where are we going, Allison? You sure you're going to be okay? Yes, so stop hovering. I won't hover anymore if we can leave. Let's try again. Nope. Alright, we're not going that way. Oh, that's right. We have to talk to the the cute guy. The cute guy that Allison... I, I'm shipping them. I ship the two right. of them. I already counted there, but I just need you to double check a few things. It's not complicated. I've got this in the bag. Oh, yeah? Because you're just yeah, like, Paladin, huh? you're right. Um, I'm just clowning. I'm clowning. I don't even know where to begin. What do I do? Yeah, let's start with an easy one. All right. Go to the back of the room and uh, 
Tell me how many cans of Molto Bene brand tomato sauce we have left. Aye, aye. Oh man, when I had a uh, when I worked in a warehouse, we had to do so much counting. It was just never ending. Every day you'd spend a couple hours just counting. Uh, no, that's not it. They said in the back. I don't think it's here. I think they're just letting me look here because I can. Um, it's a chair though. Can I just sit? I can. You're tired already? <laughs> yeah, I'm really tired, man. I need a break. I've been working all week. That's peanut butter. I wonder what's in that box. Uh, no, that's not it. All right. Don't think it's that. Don't think it's that. Here we go. Hold on. Let me count this. Fourteen. There's fourteen cans of Malta Bene tomato sauce. Okay. Sounds about right. Man, I'm so good at this. That was easy. I need you to count the bottles of bleach for me. I wonder what would happen if, uh, if we just said all wrong answers. Should I do it? The bleach isn't here. We gotta go find it. There we go. I think I saw it over here. Oh, I don't have that long to decide. Let's let's see what happens. Let's see what happens if I say there's only I'm four. I'm seeing four of them. See? You got cocky. How do you know I'm wrong? There's no way you can see them from over there. I told you I was over there earlier. Definitely more bottles than that. Fair enough. Uh, yeah. I think there are six. My bad. Uh, what's next? Come here and help me with this. All right. I can hear Harvey yelling at the door it's always as soon as i start streaming harvey i feel bad he's been really uh needy lately um what's up i need your opinion on this masterpiece <laughs> Is that supposed to be me? Yeah, come on. Look at the hair. Aw. Nailed it, right? No, I like it. Honestly, it's beautiful. A portion hey, of the screen is cut don't off? Make fun of me. Oh, you're I'm right. Not... It is. Oh, oh, shit. Maybe a little bit, but <laughs> I like it. For real. Hmm. Well, it helps to have a good model. So, this is what you're up to while I was out there doing your work? What can I say? Yeah, it's not getting the I'm captions. a multitasker. Hey, multitasker, I think you made a mistake here. All right, let's see. Yeah, it is zoomed in. It's because I'm on a new monitor. But, all right. Hmm. <laughs> There we go. Thank you. Ali, I would not have noticed that. So thank you. <laughs> At least it wasn't that much of the stream. Okay. I think we're good. Total amount should be 36. Oh, how dare you, sir? What? I just don't want you to get in trouble. Yeah, you're right. You know, I'm off my game today. All right, anything else you wanted me to check? Yep, one last thing, and then we should be free from this purgatory. Hit me. Can you count how many plushies we have in that box over there? Plushies? Okay. Only if I get to keep one. Plushies? So, these, um, 
One, two, three, four, five, six. I see eleven. I was hoping uh, they'd be like got about eleven narwhals. left in that box. Did I get it wrong? Michael? <laughs> They're so ugly, I love them. <laughs> Ouch, what the fuck? Hey, sorry. It was just too tempting. <laughs> Lesson number one in the ancient art of inventory. Never let your guard down. You have no idea what you just started. First one with three confirmed hits wins. Oh, I oh. love this. How do I do it? What's the button? Oh, damn it. I'm pushing the buttons. What button is it? So I move Oh, them. come on. Is that all you got, Ronan? Just you wait. I'm going to figure this out. Just you wait. I've got a strategy. Oh, yeah? We'll see. I'm, I'm waiting. How do I do this? Yeah, I, yeah. maybe maybe I was wrong. Maybe it wasn't Allison. How the f Okay, so change cover. Sure. Maybe not. So is this a typical work day for you? Nah, I usually don't. Oh, there we go. I can aim now. All right. Here. I'm telling Allison. I'm gonna tell Allison you said that. Ugh. Come here, man. Stuck in the office. Besides, your sister, while a hottie, isn't my type. Had to put the crosshair over the circle. Yeah, that I didn't realize I was trying to just like hit the buttons. There we go. Shoot. <laughs> Got gotcha. you. There we go. All right. Where'd he go? Now we'll change cover. So hit him once. Ready to go. There he is. Hey, is it cool that we're throwing these toys around? Aren't you guys gonna like sell them? Nah, supplier made a typo on Becky. Can't sell any of them. Cool. No harm, no foul then. Boom. <laughs> this is so cute. One more hit and you're out. Prepare to feel my wrath. God, you're corny. Yo, we better wrap this up soon. Well, yeah, you're hiding. Come here, you. Where are you going? Moving around. Boom. Yeah, Ellie, it's it's so cute. Oh. <laughs> Man, you're good. <laughs> I told you not to doubt the golden arm. <laughs> well, I'll never make that mistake again. Okay. I I need to finish this inventory thing real quick. Your sister's probably done. This is perfect shot. Here. Let's hit the bitch's grotto. The what? That's the name for the couch where Allison and I sit during breaks. Ah, all right, cool. So does Allison work here too? I get it's. I guess she does. It sounds like she does. Cause they were like. They were they were friends. We knew that Is much. That the mangy muskrat. We got another achievement or another collectible. Yeah, got him. What's in the fridge? Oh, you see that container? That's for you. Huh? What? It's the trout I caught yesterday at the buzzard hole. Grilled it up with my world-renowned marinade. That's why she couldn't just open stuff earlier. Got it. Or she could, yeah. Got it. That's actually super thoughtful. Thank you. You sound surprised. No, sorry. I'm just not used to people randomly doing nice things for me. Hey, Ellie. Oh, we'll have to fix that. Can I can I take it? Can I can I take the fish? Please. Maybe not. I want to take the fish. I also want to look around here a little bit because we haven't been back here yet. Hello, Ellie. Where are you going, babe? She 
keeps wandering. Yeah, he is dropping big flirts. Just want to make sure there's nothing else around here that I... You know, when you think about it, glass is really just tortured sand. <laughs> huh. Have you been sniffing this gray paint, Tyler? Ellie came over to say hi. Hey, baby. We're going to have a quick cat intermission. Ellie, hello. She's been such a derp today. She's been hanging out. She was sitting on my lap earlier. Usually she doesn't come hang out with me, so it's a nice... A nice change. Yeah. Are you going to stay? You can stay if you want. We'll see. Oh no, where are you going? No, no, no. Trying to get on the shelf. Cats, man. She's, she's such a cutie. She's her own person. She's, like, the most dramatic cat ever. But, um, I love her so, so much. I'm surprised Tessa let you hang this up. Yeah, she hates it. But as long as I don't promote my lifestyle in front of the customers, she doesn't say anything. Man. Oh. Must be exhausting to spend your days educating these people. <laughs> Here's the thing, I don't. Opening the minds of this town would be a full-time fucking job. And emotional labor pays shit. Do you ever get lonely? Do you ever get lonely in Delos Crossing? Yeah, sometimes. That's why I'm always in Juno working with the JCE. Meeting new people. I gotta make my shit happen for me. Because no one else will. Right. I feel you. Have you ever been with anybody here? Hey, I hope this isn't too personal, but you ever been with anyone in Delos Crossing? I dated a guy in high school for a minute, but we had to keep it quiet. I've been with a few other people, but that shit's tricky out here. And what about you? You ever been with a guy? I mean, assuming you're into guys, which <laughs> I guess I kind of did. Never met the right person. I've never really been with anybody. I guess I was too busy processing trauma or whatever. But <laughs> it's if relatable. I met a guy I was into, who knows? Anyway. And I'm done. I gotta tell you, it's so weird to finally meet the other Ronin. You mean the OG Ronin? I was born first, you know. Is that so? I thought Allison said she was. Well, our mother never actually told us, but it was me. So, why is it so weird to meet me? Because I just heard Allison tell your story so many times. She told me everything about you. The fireweed, your transition. I hope that's okay, by the way. Yeah, it's fine. She asked me first. <laughs> yeah, figures. That lady is thorough, and she loves you, like, crazy. Allison is such a good so, sister. Yeah, uh, you were probably the first person to know about it other than Allison. I'm glad you trusted me. And it's great to finally get to know you in the flesh. You're pretty alright. You're not too bad yourself. <laughs> but you're not too bad yourself. I try not to be. Especially around guys I'm trying to impress. Aww, so flirting is real. Juno with us. Oh, this is so heartwarming. I love it. I've got a community there. It could be yours, too. Hmm. Fitting in. There's a concept. You have no idea how life-saving a chosen family can be. They pull me out of the dark more times than I can count. I hear you. Hey, can I ask you a question? Of course. Shoot. Why do you care so much if I move to Juno? <laughs> Look, like I said, I I want to get to know you. 
Because I'm just that fascinating, huh? <laughs> Honestly, yeah. I think you might be one of a kind, Tyler Ronan. Um, yeah, Allie, good point. Yeah, after after Tyler totally took the fall for her, uh, it's it's good that she is has been a a good sister. I know this is so cute. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm right. I'm right with you, Allie. Um, you're pretty swell too. Well, golly gee, Michael, I think you're swell too. Oh! <laughs> Shut up! I've got way better compliments than that, but I can't open with my best, right? It's cool. So, I'll get more of those if I get to know you better. For sure. If that's something you'd be interested in. I might be. Yeah. <clears throat> oh. This is so much better I've been than I expected. I've at that counter for an hour waiting for you two dum-dums to come back. Are you guys ready to go? Mm-hmm. I think we've done about as much damage as we can back here. Yeah. Let's go. Alright. And now we're going to the graveyard to rip out our hearts. The game was like, we're going to make you feel good for a minute before we make you feel bad. You know it's coming. Here we are. Thanks for letting me hit your ride over. No problem. You sure we can't drive you back? Nah. You're like stretching my legs. It isn't far. And anyway, can't put the wind in a bottle. <laughs> All right. Sorry about the Tessa should noise. be at her parents' grave, not far from the entrance. Look for a big crooked tree. You can't miss it. I'm gonna go check in with my uncle. Good luck. For real. Oh, deep breathing. Okay. Is it lagging for anyone else? You look pretty spooked. I've never been a big fan. Yeah, I'm gonna get a new graphics card soon. I think it's it's time that I um it's time that I upgraded. Man, still not good. Why do we always come here? Does it bother you? No. It's just weird because we don't know any of these people. I mean, except Eddie's mom. It never hurts to say hello. Because they're very lonely. It's better? Okay, oh, it's phew. Okay. And sometimes, even if you can't see them, they stay with you. In here. Always here. Mom? <laughs> always. She loved us a lot, but sometimes it was like loving us hurt her. Do you think she was just really scared of losing us? There we go. All right, awesome. Okay, good. I guess that's what it was. It was just I that know. I was recording this time and my CPU is like, nope. <laughs> All good, right? Okay, great. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Because it's weird, because I can't like see how the stream looks from my end, because I just have like OBS up. And so it's, um, I try not to run, like, any other programs just to be safe. You woke up when you heard the voice and volume change. Gotcha. <laughs> Welcome in. <laughs> I hope you had a nice nap. The 40-day party is observed 40 days after the passing to pay respects to the departed. Some believe this is more recent tradition. Family members organized a shared meal where a fire dish, one plate of food, is burned to nourish and comfort the spirit of the departed. That's nice. Due to the natural outlawing of native religions and ways of life, much of our knowledge of the old ways... <gasps> Oh, Gesundheit! <laughs> Gesundheit, Allison! <laughs> uh, 
uh, spiritual practice has been lost below there uh, below our two everlasting examples of love and uh, reverence 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 there we go uh, we continue to show our departed in the, the tradition of our ancestors Oh, thank you, Pyro. Yeah, way back in the day. I was just saying, um, earlier today, oh, we were talking dream, about uh, high school reunions, and I realized that ours would be, like, next year, and I was like, I don't know if I'll go, because the only person that I'd really, like, want to see is Pyro, so it would be better if we just, like, got lunch. <laughs> this might take a while. There's Michael. Michael? Thank you for the uh, for the follow, Violet Box. Fox. I can speak today, I swear. Ben. Short and simple. I like it. Come on. There's only a handful left. This is such a an old graveyard. Lewis. Wasn't he that fancy fisherman? Yep. Eddie still watches reruns of the show he was on. Every once in a while his face pops up. It's super weird. You're seriously racking your brain for anyone else in our grave yeah, that you would want to see. Yeah, there's there's like a couple of people that I would like enjoy seeing. But there's there's not too many that I've like stayed in touch with. Um, Lost in the chaos of history. What's that mean? Not sure, but Michael should know. You ordered pizza and it's walking up right now. Oh yeah. I am I am super jealous. I made dinner before the stream, but it was like. I don't know, pretty basic. I like that each one of these has its own little little blurb to it. Wait, is this the one we called Big Crookedy? The exact one. Why didn't we call it Gnarl's Branching? Total missed opportunity. <laughs> because we weren't hip to basketball back then? Or CeeLo Green? Yeah. I remember it going all the way up to the clouds. Everything does when you're four feet tall. Yazzie. Why does that sound familiar? Yazzie Trucking. He used to haul lumber for the sawmill. Oh, yeah. And he always blasts the horn for us. Did we look at this one? Leon. That's the one. <sighs> Don't tell me we missed her. Well, that's Hello, an eagle. Mr. Eagle? Kids. Time. Gonna head out and eat. Uh, have a good night. Thank you very much. Thanks for hanging out. I hope you enjoy your food. Hope it's very tasty. Quick, okay? Then we'll get something to eat. The day of the funeral. I barely remember. That's probably for the best. I don't think either of us are exactly eager to relive what went on behind that gate. So... I know I said we didn't have to visit her grave. But it feels like the right thing to do. Yeah, exactly. Let's do it, Allison. Man, I'm still surprised that the 
the stream dropped quality like so suddenly. Like I had been recording the whole time. Allison, please. I'm, I'm not going. Allison, come back. <sighs> yeah. And he hoped that this would be easier than last time. Totally gone. At least this time, no one's sending me away. I'm holding you to that. Afterwards, you and I had a moment over there by the totem, right? I wonder if we could see that. Doesn't hurt to check. Let's give it a shot. I do love this remember mechanic. I think it's so neat. I won't let them take you away. I'm gonna tell them the truth. You swore, Allison. I'm gonna be okay. Please, don't worry about me. I know I'm supposed to get over this brown thing, but I really wish you'd been able to come visit that much. Yeah, me too, but look, I didn't make any promises that day. You did, watch. definitely very cool yeah it's like i like that you get to see both perspectives from each of them and how different they are they all think you killed her it's not fair i'll be okay you have to take care of yourself now see it's possible but i don't think so well i know so thinking about it got me through the rest of the day but I'm going to come see you every week. Uh. And we'll talk with our voice every day. But I'm going to come see you every week. And I'll be back soon, all right? Promise. And I'll be back soon, hmm. all right? And we'll talk with our voice every Man, I feel like because Promise. Allison didn't get to visit, we should choose... I'll be back soon, all right? Promise. I'm going to choose oh, Allison's yes, memory. Right. Chief Brown's going to take care of you. We'll be okay. You'll see. Kid. It's a little bit less less blame, I think. About to start. I'm sorry it took me so long to come back. I got so caught up in everything that you really don't have to explain. I yeah. Understand what you were going through now. Are you ever going to let me finish my sentences? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe someday. But not today. Yeah, I feel like there's a bit more bit more camaraderie there. I didn't like I remember one time I, I picked one that I was like, eh, I like this option better, but it divided them more, and I, I don't want to do that. Is this Michael over here? Doesn't look like him. You're not today nice nope. skating on Wednesday. I wish you could have seen her. Oh, hi. I didn't see you there. I'm sorry. We didn't mean to eavesdrop. No harm done. Hey, you're that nice gal from the Vecchi store. Allison, right? Yes. And you're... Um... It starts with a K, right? Kendra. Don't worry. Don't expect you to keep track of everyone who passes through. And you would be... Her brother. I'm Tyler. Pleased to meet you, Tyler. Oh, we don't need to ask her about her accent. Sorry. We have to get going. Don't apologize. It was nice talking to you. See you around, Kendra. You do have a good day. I was so terrible at remembering um, remembering customer names when I worked in retail. Like, just trying to remember the regulars. You two know each other? Welcome to Delos Crossing, where even the beavers have to shop at the Beckys. This one? I'm gonna have a look around, okay? I'll be right back. Yeah, all good. Have a look around, okay. Not this one. It's 
Still not the one. Oh, okay. He does just want me to find their mother's grave. Not that one. No dice. Why can't I remember? I'm pretty sure it's just that one right there, isn't it? I still have the helmet. Sorry. Never mind. All I remember is a bird jumping around on a stump during the funeral. A bird jumping around on a stump. There it is. Is that her? What the hell was going on with you? What broke? <laughs> Allie, you're back just I in time to cry. We were your goblins. <laughs> you didn't have to do it all alone. I wasn't expecting to see. But what are you? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Feeling a little guilty, maybe? We can't be sad and mean at the same time. Allison. When we pass on, our graves are all anyone has to remember. We totally us can. <laughs> Letting hers just fall apart would be cruel. I'm not a cruel person. Cruel enough to call social services on our mother. I, I'm still not convinced I, I that that was you. the wrong Marianne thing was to getting do. Worse all the time. I was afraid that if things kept going the way they were, then one day we were going to end up dead. No, I won't do this again. I refuse to be held responsible for her choices. Marianne was fine until you reported her. Fine? She was getting by on handouts for years. There are only so many times you can show up high to a generous offer of employment. Assuming you show up at all. In the end, she isolated herself from everyone. She was alone and out of options. She had us! Until you threatened to have us taken away. I couldn't let her drag you down with her. She had you stealing for God's sake. Your mother never wanted to be a part of this community. She always thought she was better than the rest of us. A spoiled little girl playing fairy princess in the woods. If she just settled down with someone instead of running around with married men, well... Just ask Sam Kansky how much better that would have been for everyone. Wait, what? I... Oh, God. What happened between them? I, I wasn't thinking. Please, just forget I said anything. Tessa! All I know is whatever went on, Laura left Sam over it. But I shouldn't have said anything about that. I promised I wouldn't. I'm sorry, kids. Yeah, Ali. Yeah, yeah you're right. It, was, uh, it wasn't wrong, but it was handled poorly. That is true. Um. Um. I kind of want to want to choose the first option because I feel like that's what they would say. I think that the second one would be out of character for them. I'm going to pick the first one. I get that Marianne wouldn't let you help her. But there had to be a better way to deal with it. Especially if she was having some kind of crisis. 
Yes, you're right. There were other things I could have done. Better things. I know I've made mistakes. All I can do now is say that I'm sorry. If I could give you back your mother, I would. I don't deserve your forgiveness, especially yours, Tyler. But if there's a place for me in your lives, I'd like to be there. I have to know something first. Are you good with who I am? I've been thinking about that since you came home. I believe that my life is better for having lived it by God's word. But I also believe we don't always understand what he's saying to us. I pray for guidance. And seeing you standing here in front of me, such a strong and thoughtful young man. I think I have his answer. That means a lot to me. Thank you. Tessa, I know the last couple of days have been... hated. I'm up for a fresh start if you are, but it's not really up to me. Tyler? Ooh, chat. What do you think? I'm... Mm. I think we can... I think we can forgive her. Yeah, right, Allie? We can we can just like throw that throw that whole speech to the wind. <laughs> I also think Tyler's been pretty forgiving. Yeah, let's let's do it. We we didn't forgive the the cop yeah, at and first and then people grow, work to it later. And what the hell kind of chance do we have? Thank you. Both of you. Kids, I never knew your mother's whole story. But it was obviously very painful. She always said you two were the only good luck she'd ever had. I'm going to try harder to forgive her. I hope you can as well. If you two are in town tomorrow, come by the cafe. Lunch is on me. They're going to be coconut cake on the menu? You know, I think there just might be. I'll see you two tomorrow then. We'll be there. Come on. That was something, huh? Yeah, it was. I had pretty much given up on her, but I guess sometimes people change. I know. I feel like a total ass right now. She needed to hear that. You shouldn't. She needed to hear all of that. Yeah, you're probably right. Still, I might bring in a peace offering my first day back. Any ideas? That's right, that uh, is her boss. <laughs> <laughs> kind of Maybe forgot I'll just that. Bring back that book I borrowed six months ago. You want to sit down for a bit? Oh yeah, bench mechanic. I love it. Not a bad view, right? Yeah, I get now why they put cemeteries in nice spots. Takes a little bit of the sting off. Thanks for coming with me. Listen, I know this has been hard. I'm really grateful you saw it through with me. Fireweed was great, but there was no one really there for me like that. You know, you're the only one. Hey, brothers and sisters, right? But it's been way more brothers than sisters lately, which is why I'm trying to say thank you. You really don't have to. You saved my life, Allison. Only for you to end up locked up in fireweed for the rest of your childhood. Wait, are you still blaming yourself for that? Don't. It was my choice. It's just... I stole your life, Tyler. And then I totally wasted it. That's not true. You're on your way to Denali. Michael's gonna be a famous chef. And, and what am I doing? Nothing. You were just dealing with what happened the way that you needed to, all right? As soon as we figure this shit out, we're gonna sell the house, and you're gonna go to Juno. You're gonna kick ass. You make it sound so easy. No. 
We never had a shot at easy, but we always pull through, right? Yeah, you're right. Hey, wherever Ranger Tyler ends up next, he better come down from the hills to visit us city folk every now and then. You hear? For sure. And anyway, it's not gonna be for a while. We've got time. Oh yeah, of course. We do. Oh. So I guess we know the story now, huh? Marianne was done with Delos. Delos was done with her. Don't even know most of the story and already love it. And yeah, it really does suck you in. She worked so hard for so long, and when she reached the end of her rope, no one was there to help her. Not even Tessa. Or Eddie. And when she heard social services was coming, she... She... Gave up. But killed her kids? Really? I don't know. It still feels like there's something missing. Right? Well, there was that monster that we saw. You're never gonna understand what was going through her mind. I'll bet even she didn't. It's probably always going to feel that way. <laughs> Monster. Yeah, so uh, earlier in the chapter, we saw this crazy, like, cloaked Ooh. creature with a I'm giant, like, smile couch. that was super freaky. Rally. We, still have to do some we don't know anything that. about it yet. Uh, do we have to? Hey. Whoever packs the most gets the big couch tonight. I know, they're so sweet. I was gonna say earlier, but they were talking so much. I, I love when games will the force the, the player or suggest to the player to sit on a bench because it's just the game telling, oh shit, I jumped a little bit. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Oh, damn. Tyler, are you alright? Uh, Allison, Barn. Stay there. I got it. Um. But yeah, so the. I feel like when, when the. When the player is suggested to sit on a bench, it's the game devs tell. Trying to tell you. Um. Look at how good we are at making this game. But also, what is happening here? So, fire was set um, by... Was, it looked like a guy. A guy. He smashed me in the face with the door. What guy? What did he look like? I'm not sure. I couldn't see straight, and, and he was all in black. Why would someone try to burn down our barn? Yeah, getting more know. mystery. But I'm going to find out. I want to go and look over there, but I also want to... Some kind of work boot. Maybe fishing boots? Uh, I feel like this is going to continue the story, so let's let's check the barn first. I really want to go down there. Um, I swear it wasn't you. <laughs> yeah, and Life is Strange, they had a bunch of places to sit, and it made, made you very happy. I'm glad they continued it in this game. Yeah, I um, there's a, uh, a game called uh, Brothers, A Tale of Two Sons, where... It's a, it's a very artistic game, and there are benches in each, like, area. And if you sit down, it just pans out and just shows you how beautiful the area is. And it's it's just so Did he really have so, to smash so cool. everything? What are you looking he for? Looking under the rug? Something under the floorboard? Hey, come check this out. Is that a box under the barn? Yeah. When Cloud sits on a bench in Final started. Fantasy VII, so you just look around and admire the graphics. We should check it out. I'm gonna need yeah. to move a few more planks to get to it. Hmm. Yeah, this Where is from the Life is Strange find devs. A tool to do that. Huh. These planks look newer than the rest. That corner used to be all dirt, or chickens. 
She was always saying how she was going to make this place a real homestead. Little house on the tundra. Mm. None of the valuable stuff's missing. I would like a crowbar. I need a crowbar, please. Here we go. I guess we know how he made the hole. Asshole even dumped the drawers. At least you were spared. God. Really Gotta get those collectibles. So we only know we know one guy who has a key. Well, I only know one person who'd bother to decorate a storage box like this. Marianne. Let's open it. Three digits. Any ideas? Mm. Marianne was never really a numbers kind of person. What's that there? Some kind of carving. Not sure what it is though. Okay, oops. Let's get the... I didn't want to leave. I do kind of... Like, should we go come back to this? Like, I want to go and look at the... This... I don't know. I'm so torn. I, I want to go and see everything, but I don't want to accidentally um, advance the plot. Mm. Yeah, right? Thank Why God. can't we just smash the box? Damn. He ran straight for it. No stops. Trail ends here. It looks like he jumped into the gully. You think he followed it down to the lake? Yeah, I mean, if he'd gone the other way, he'd have come right back. Hey, are there footsteps on the other side? Yeah, that must be where he climbed out. Well, he's long gone. All right. Okay, cool. That's all I was looking for. I just, like, wanted to make sure that he wasn't just, like, hiding over here, right? Okay, so now we'll go back. We'll do the box. And we'll get that three-digit code. It's always a tough one, right? Yeah, because I want to be able to see everything that the game has to offer, but it's it's hard when you don't exactly know. All right, so it's just. I think we just need to break the lock. There must be something in here we can use to get it open, and preferably without destroying the box. Oh, we're just gonna break the box this time. I'm cool with it. Like we can go try to figure out the code, but I'd rather just break the lock. Yeah, wire cutters. Yeah, that'll break a lock. Let's go. Let's not waste time. Yeah, with my track record, we'd be in that book for 20 minutes. And then garlic would tell me what the combination is. <laughs> it's just notes. Yeah, it's a small log. It's only three numbers. I'm sure we would have figured it out. I'm just making a nod to the last stream where I was, like, just struggling with it a lot. Dear Marianne, I need to see you again. I know how this sounds, and I don't want you to think I chase after all the new girls in Delos Crossing. I've always taken my vows seriously, but something changed when I met you. When we're together, I feel like I'm doing 80 down the highway with my lights off, and I never want to stop. I know this isn't right, and we both have a lot to lose, but I need you to uh, to be with you again. Uh, I hope you feel the same. P.S. I brought you a little something for next time. I can't wait to see how it looks on you. Fuck. That's rough. Marianne, I'm sorry you're in this situation. I know... This, uh, this guy tried to push Marianne to get an abortion. I don't know she wanted to keep us. Damn, I'm still reading, Tyler. Uh, sorry in the situation. I know you feel you'd make a great mother, and I don't doubt you will someday, but right now we have to be sure we don't ruin three lives. My marriage hasn't been happy for some time, uh, but she doesn't deserve this. 
Mostly I'm worried about you. People here talk and I don't want you to have to go through that. I know money has been tight, but I'll do what I can to help you do the right thing. Just let me know how much you need. Jesus. Way to have it be a, you know, a joint conversation. Fuck. It's like, here, you do this. I'll pay for it, but fuck your opinion. God. All right. everything. What the hell? So... Yeah, gross. Marianne hid a box under the barn. A box full of letters from our deadbeat dad. Came for the letters, I guess? He turned the whole place upside down and didn't take anything. All he wanted was that box. And he was willing to burn down the barn to get rid of what was inside. He's wearing fishing gear? So, I... I think he was wearing fishing gear. Fishing gear? Does that mean... Let's not jump to any conclusions. Half the town's probably got the same gear. Yeah, I think I know... I think I know where this is going, but... We'll see. Allison! Allison! Why are we seeing this? I don't know about you, but I haven't forgotten anything about that night. I would have said the same thing, but something felt different. I need to see the rest. But you know what happens down there. That's the thing. I'm not sure I do. Can I make some food? Enjoy your food. The Mad Hunter. Wait. There was someone here that night? In the woods? No. It was just... I, s I saw... Who the hell did I actually see? The Mad Hunter! What? No. That... That was the Mad Hunter. What? What are you talking about? That night... I... Thought I saw the Mad Hunter in the woods. But I guess it was just some asshole. Some asshole who just fucking stood there and watched while our mother chased me with a shotgun. Do you think it was the same guy? Maybe. I mean, it had to be him, right? They were wearing the same fishing gear. Yeah, unless everyone who wants to mess with us is coordinating outfits. And wait, he was here once before, wasn't he? A few days before Marianne died? Maybe. Hold on, do you feel that? Tyler, not there. Our mother fought with someone on the dock. About us. We need to know if it was the same guy. But what if it's not that memory? What if it's... I can't go through that again. We have to take that chance. But do we really? I mean, someone just tried to burn our barn down. Yeah, and that means we've got to be close to something. I'm not going on that dock. Oh, that's that's pretty that's that's pretty aggressive. Um just one more time. Just one more time. Please. There's always just one more. Every time it seems like we're done with this, something new pops up. What if this is the only chance to figure out who our father is? Then we go on living our lives without him just like we always have. Come on, we need to know the truth for her. What if I don't want to know the truth? Huh? Did you ever consider that? No. You just push and push and- You have to take responsibility for your part in Marianne's death. What? How? How? 
can you say that to me? I didn't. But I, I did, right? Earlier, to Eddie. But I, I swear I didn't just say that to you. So we can't even trust our own voices now? God, I, I don't know. It's getting Alice. weird. I'll do it. Let's go. Oh man, struggling to pull the pull the memory. Stepping on my foot. Can you hear what they're saying? Quiet. I don't want mom to catch us out of bed. I told you, I told you that would happen. We almost had it though. That was us watching Marianne fight with that guy. Try to focus on him, all right? Don't think about anything else. These weird, like, split memories. They're both brave. Yeah, I agree. I don't owe you anything. You've been a little all over the place lately. All over the place? I've just been trying to survive. If you want to make sure I don't get desperate, you could help us out. Lend me some money. What happened? Why did it stop? I can't, Tyler. But we were so damn close. Oh, poor Allison. This must be so hard for them both. I'm sorry, but I'm done. That's it? You're just giving up, just like that. You can't do this. We owe her. Marianne is gone, Tyler. And nothing we do is gonna change that. Don't go, please. You can't keep running from this alley, or it's only gonna get worse. That's rough. It's like, there's no good, good option there. Like, she's not wrong for not wanting to do it. it. You're stepping on my foot. Can you hear what they're saying? Ooh, are we Quiet. gonna get to find out, Don't though? Don't want mom to catch us out of bed. There's no money. I've never asked you for anything, but right now they need you. It's not gonna happen. I've got everything I need to nail your ass in that barn. And just what do you think happens after that? <sighs> what do you mean? Well, if those kids have a father, you really think there's a court out there that'll let you keep them? No! You have no claim to my children! Get the hell off my property, now! If you ever come back here, I'm going to kill you! Allison? I'm going to kill you. No, no, no. I'm going to kill you. What? 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 Excuse me? That's where we're ending? 
I'm just gonna start the next chapter because I mean I've only been streaming for an hour but also what was going on there with Allison and Allie I think you're right there's there's a reason she hasn't done anything with her life ahead of letting um, letting this hold her back yeah it's it's there's something else going on and there's a whole other chapter to explore it <laughs> so yeah I'm gonna I'm gonna keep playing a little bit I'm definitely gonna finish this this weekend so I'm not gonna do the whole chapter four but I'll do another another hour or two um, yeah Ali she's holding something back for sure Uh, I think I'm also gonna gonna let the cats do their door shuffling. So I'll be right back while the credits are going. <laughs> 